Today we are playing Arsenal. They are quite good. They're currently second in the Premier League. Uh, and also, just a little fun fact for you, they also won the Champions League last year. So I reckon we're going to smash them 5 0 on aggregate. Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome back. We've had no games because we're in the winter break. Ask got any horrific injuries, Arsenal? Bamba's out. I don't know why I'm looking at him because, oh, he's good. Go cool. on, that's a big miss. Probably got loads of players like that. Okay, okay, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, we're pretty much fit. Gux is the only one that's missing. Kim's a little bit knackered. Noriyuki and Takas are both back. Ken's going to start as the number 10. Humberto's gone off a little bit. And Ken is the legend. A legend of the club. Form-wise, we're not that good because we've had some horrifically difficult games recently. And a bunch of random friendlies. Oh, I die. <laughs> I enjoy playing in the Champions. I don't want to see this. <laughs> Do we change how we put... No, we... This has got... This tactic has got us some good results against bigger teams. Oh, Takas is aroused. I think I think that's what it said. Right. Let's go. It's a classic. Nobody is expecting anything from us, lads. Apologies, there was no video yesterday. We just had a lovely sunny day. And um, doesn't happen very often over here. And we've had, like, no rain for two days. It's a big deal. And then a sunny day, and my lawn is six foot high, and so it was time to mow. <laughs> and time to ooh, not concede, because we are solid at the back. All right, just keep it close. Oh, I don't like the amount of highlights this early onwards. Nice one, Holgaard, doing his defensive work. Our Arsenal in the playoffs is... That's annoying, isn't it? Paz... Oh, Pavel's got to save that! Oh, this doesn't bode well. Well, we got minimum requirements this season was to get into the playoffs. We've achieved it. Now, he buys us one more season, which we have to get to the knockouts. Either through the playoffs or just finishing the top eight. We have to see improvement. Or be it's it's weird because a lot I like I quite enjoy when we in one of my favourite things about the journeyman is when we leave clubs and we sort of see how they get on and everything. And usually the AI kind of sucks, right? You know, you leave a club in a great position and then you check back two years later and they've been relegated. But this team is so beyond, like it's so much better. Go on, go on, go on stackers, get in there. Get in there. Well done, Ken. He took one for the team there. But this team is so above everybody else in the league that surely whoever comes in just continues to win the league. Like, bare minimum continues to win the league. But I still have a sneaking suspicion that they might not. Oh, no. Yes, good tackle. Tackle him, tackle him. Oh, he's just done him. Yes, better, Pavel, better. Right. Come on, look at this packed stadium here. And also, like, if we do leave, the new manager's going to have a new stadium. <laughs> it's like, it's set up. It's set up for the new next manager. It's not even close. Don't know why I did some scat singing then, but let's just move on. Okay. Defending was a little bit desperate, lads. But we're one all. Our best hope is just to keep it tight and then just try and nick it. Noriyuki's not really been involved so far. Zeke's looking aggressive, but he always just that's just his face. Okay. Same again. A little bit. More relaxed. Let's let's call it professional defending. You know. Oh, there's the ball. It's gonna near our goal. Let me just clear it away. Yeah. Let's not just scramble about. In Barcelona, Roma won all. Won all. Hibs and Man United. 
There are some big boys in this knockout. Real Madrid. Okay. <sighs> Trouble is, this is the home leg. <laughs> that's the only. That's the only. My biggest worry here is like this. I feel like this might be as good as it gets. He hasn't quite got the crossing ability, but he's got all the other attributes required. And Noriyuki's having a quiet game. Donna. Sergi's having a bit of a shocker. Okay, stay, stay as is, boys. Stay as is. One little chance. Nick it 2-1. Take it back to their place. Nil-nil ball draw. Yeah? Don't think I'm going to make any more subs. We've got Copenhagen in the league next, but I'm happy to throw that because we're miles ahead anyway, so I can just throw that. And... All right, that's as good as realistically we could have hoped for. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be very positive about that. I worry, though, that they outplayed us at home and the away leg, they might just murder us. That's the only thing. Liverpool 3 all with Lazio. Jesus, there's some big old boys in this playoff, isn't it? We need a top eight. <laughs> this, this is such a hard playoff to do. Right, Copenhagen, we're just going to, you know, because we're 700 points clear at the top of the league, I think, when the last time I checked. I'll just make sure, just in case we've got... Yeah, we're, we're, yeah. Yeah, okay, we're just ahead. So we should be fine to be able to rest players for a game. <laughs> I swear to God, if the next manager doesn't, win the league with this team then all hope is lost right okay on to the second leg a heroic comeback with a rotated scores against Copenhagen Ken came on to rescue us three points are we undefeated yeah we are undefeated in the league Stephanie and Invincible season's on but you know we'll stay tuned because this could be a tight title I'd have to just stop Turning up at to games, I think, to actually have a chance of not winning the league so far this season. Right. Okay, boys. Fitness is good. Uh, we are making a signing. A speculative signing. It's Milos Skulak. He's a 16-year-old Croatian attacker. I'm buying for three and a half million. Up to seven if he plays a bunch of games for us. Don't know if he's going to make it. This might be an absolute punt. But he's 16 years old. Worst that can happen, he doesn't really develop and he's worth he's still gonna be worth a chunk of money. You know, Noriyuki has not been on form recently. He had international duty and a little knock, and he's not quite been himself. The whole team is not playing exceptionally well at the moment. And now we're gonna get battered by Arsenal. Or are we yes. Yes. Oh yes. Or will Ken be the hero that we need? <sighs> it's going to have to be something special, lads. I'm recording this the morning of the England-Denmark game. So I'm going to tell you the result now, even though this will come out officially after it happens. Um, so I'll give you some betting advice. England are going to beat Denmark... 4-0. <laughs> okay. So, put a couple of quid on it. You're welcome. 4-0. This won't come back to bite me in any way, shape, or form. 4-0. Okay, we've got the ball. We haven't got the ball. We have lost the ball. The new guy, our little ginger Brazilian, is, is playing quite well. I think long-term we could upgrade him, but I really, like I said... We've got such good players. Go on, get a tackling. Oh, we spaffed it over. We, we're in that weird spot where we've got money's not a problem. But just the league that we're in and the size of the squad we are, we just cannot improve. We have to get youngsters and make them world beaters. It's, it's, it's very, very difficult if you just we just need somebody now. And I'm not... I'm just... I don't know what it is, but the that sort of legendary old guy that's now 33 never, ever works out for me. I don't know what it is. Go on, go on, Takas. Little flicked header. 
It never works out. They're just a bunch of Eden Hazards. And you're not paying far too much money for a guy that sits on the bench. Go on, Ken. Go on, Ken. We're looking decent. Battle for it, Ken. Battle for it. It's a decent ball across. Okay, it's another little chance. We're definitely holding our own. I would take penalties. <laughs> if offered. Oh, the doctor scored for Liverpool. Is it? Could we? We could. Could we? Could we do this? Got some time, Ori. He's tired, but Gux is only just back from injury. Could go Drost. <clears throat> come on, boys. Come on. Come on. This is better than I thought we were going to play. We're getting FM'd, if anything. Come on. Like, I feel like a Ken Winner's on the cards. Come on. I just yeah, keep looking at the momentum's good. We've had more possession this second half. I, I kinda want it. Oh no. Oh no. This could be the winning highlight. Good tackle. Kim does the right thing. Eisencock, calm, calm. Kim, <laughs> out wide if you need. All right, okay, good. This is lovely. That's shit. That was shit, wasn't it, Pavel? I think he just got pissed off for being passed back to, and he's like, just fuck off. Oh, I don't. It smells gold, doesn't it? Oh, it smells like a terrible penalty decision. I really hope the game fixes. I want a penalty to look like a penalty. I don't think I'm asking too much for next game. That's all I want. <laughs> Backgrounds to stadiums and penalties that look like penalties. Oh, Pavel got there. Oh, man. I'm going to get done by a penalty. We've got some tired old legs outside. Right, Ken's staying on because I said he's going to get the winners. So he has to obviously be there. That's quite an important part of it. Okay. Going with Drost. Okay, hang on. What what magic can I pull out of my arse here? <laughs> Takas really needs to come off. Noriyuki definitely has to come off, right? We've got Drost, who's right-footed. He's got a decent left foot. We've got Furtado, who is left-footed, but cannot cross. This is the only... And I would... Okay. I'm going to play, I'm going to do this, right? But now I need a wing back. Now, technically, he could do it. He's much more defensive. And I don't think we've got anybody else that can really do it. Right. Time for the big boy. <laughs> the giant, the six foot five giant lumbering forward like an ent. Right. Okay, that's one. That's that side done. He's going to cut inside. We're right, late in the box. Heading ability. Bosh! Goals. Okay, we go attacking. Scans out. I've got to keep tackers on. Anybody want to come on and do a bit of magic? Right, Drost is definitely there. Um, Hugo's having a bit of a shocker. Kokak is just, he's just not attacking. He's just... Crap at attacking. He did play all right, though, and his fresh legs. I think that outweighs a poor performance, not knowing the position. Fresh legs, just can't cross. <laughs> it's not It's not an ideal. Actually, um, no, no. I didn't want Drost. I meant Larson. Um, okay. And then we're going to just... <sighs> Do all the buttons. We're doing all the buttons. It's it's that sort of time I feel like. I mean, I'm just gonna push the tempo up a little bit. Gonna, gonna try and stretch them a bit more. Is that it? Don't wanna make any more subs. I could just go freshen up in defense. Rios is very good and he's on a yellow card. Might as well go very attacking. 
That's it. That's it. <sighs> Dodgy penalty. Yes, yes, well done. Well, yes, well done. Okay. That's what we want to see. A kickoff highlight. Good. Come on, Ken. You need to be a little bit further forward if you're going to get that goal, Ken. I know I said deep line forward. That's a nice early ball. I like the idea. He's played it through us. Quadrago. One stop the cross. Oh, Gasparini's done really well. Larson. Oh. Oh, Gasparini's won it again. Is Ken onside? Oh, he's taking a heavy touch. Oh, he's offside. It's a great finish. Oh. oh, man. It's almost worse that we were closer. If we just got beat, I would have gone, yeah, well, Arsenal just won the Champions League last season, of course. Three. Oh, so close. Well, Larson, take his legs off. Unlucky, boys. Go on, Pav. Go. Go, Pav. No. Oh, boobies! Underdogs. Bucks. Fed up with being the underdogs. I'm just going to go to Barcelona. Okay, more well, hips. They tried to hold on. Uh, but they lost a uh, 5-1 in their return leg. Uh, Bayern, Chelsea. Oh, so get off the Real Madrid, Barcelona. Yeah. As expected. Well, that's the boring bit of the season done, as we know. Please with that. Oh, all right. Shut up, Graham Potter, you failure. Um, as we know, <laughs> that's the boring bit. Now it's the exciting title race, which I will skip through. For your pleasure, as fast as humanly possible, because I don't think much is going to happen. Unless, unless we have, this will be the bottleist of bottly jobs, if we could somehow lose the league 20 points ahead after half a season. Um, how many points did we get last season? Can we... No, I was going to say 58. How do we manage that? Um, is there not just a... Because it counts. 83 points after 32. I think we might beat that, boys. We only won the league by 19 points last season. <sighs> Another year. Another sort of... felt closer, didn't it? It felt close. It felt good this season. Arsenal, obviously one of the best teams in Europe. But, like, we gave Liverpool a really good game. <sighs> this, we probably should have done better with this result. Anderlecht was okay. But we beat Napoli away from home. We beat Real Madrid at home. Dynamo Kiev, we spanked them, slapped them about a bit. Panathinaikos slapped them. Nice. Nice was probably the only real bad result in that. And we started early on. Oh, bum. Right. One more go to get to the knockout stages. Join me. Hang on, I've got to sell it because it's YouTube. Join me for the exciting next episode to see if I might win the league. And remember, get a fiver on England beating Denmark 4-0. It's going to happen, trust me. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great evening. Bye-bye.